We have got our Bronte Creek 5 and 10K race for the Ukraine, which is on Sunday, May 29th, right here at beautiful Bronte Park. There's a 5K and a 10K. The 10K is a double loop. And so far we have about 250 people, but hoping to double that. And we've raised $13,000 for the Ukraine at this point. And our goal is 20,000. So we are so excited. After more than two years of hosting virtual races, Kelly's excited to see all the athletes in person once again. We really tried at the beginning to keep people encouraged and we had some great virtual races, raised quite a bit of money for the hospitals, but now it's at the point where people want to be back. They are so happy to be out running again. Um, the beginning of the pandemic, a lot of people started running and walking, so we have a lot of new customers, which is great. And then there have been a small group of people that have gained a little bit of weight possibly and maybe drank too many cocktails. And so it's a good way to start to get fit again. And you know, a lot of our races are not strictly geared for super fast people. We welcome walkers. We welcome people that want to do their very first 5K and 10K. And Bronny Park is a great one to do it at. And I just want to say that we've got some great sponsors with this race and some local businesses that are all getting behind this to help us raise a lot of money for the Ukraine. We have our own um, site with the Red Cross, which all that information is on our website, so you can actually click directly. Even actually, if you just want to raise money for the Ukraine and not get involved in our race, that's fine too. This is all to do something good for the Ukraine and the situation that's going on there. Reporting for Halton News, I'm Nikki Wesley.